The Monasteries Philodio Monastery History Among the Byzantine emperors who made donations to the monastery, the names of Nicephorus Botaniates in the 11th century, Andronicus II and Andronicus III and John V in the late 13th and in the 14th century stand out. Among Serbian princes, Stefan Dushan, 1346, helped to provide the manpower for the monastery. In the 14th century, Saint Theodosius, subsequently Metropolitan of Byzond, and brother of Saint Dionysius, founder of the monastery of that name, was a monk in the monastery. During the early years of Turkish rule, in the early 16th century, the abbot Dionysios, known as the Blessed Dionysios of Olympus, succeeded in turning it from an idiorhythmic into a kinobitic monastery. However, the reaction of Bulgarian-speaking monks was such that he was forced to leave the monastery. In about the mid-17th century, the Tsars of Russia gave permission to the monks to go there every seven years on arms missions. The policy of support for the monasteries was also followed by the Greek princes of the Danubian provinces. Gregorio Zykas was one of the monastery's best known benefactors. In the 18th century the missionary of modern Greece Saint Cosmas the Aetolian was a monk at Philodio. A fire which broke out in 1871 left unscathed the new Catholicon, which had been built in 1746 on the foundations of an older church, but caused the monastery economic problems, so that in 1900 the Holy Community took it under its guardianship. Of the other buildings of the monastery, the holy water file is of fine white marble, and the refectory was extended in the 16th century.